see the trap and I'm flipping it. Double cup with the purple, I'm sipping it. Hey, hey, I might pull up where you stay. I might pull up, let it spread. What's good, YouTube? It's Constant, and I'm back with another MB2 k 20 Madison video. Today, I'm going to be starting a new series on this channel, and it's going to be based around RJ Barrett. It's going to be called RJ's. RJ Barrett's Road to Glory. So I'm basically gonna be playing with this old Ruby team right here. And our best player is gonna be Pink Diamond RJ Barrett. And I'm gonna have a series of upgrades and downgrades. And we're gonna be playing multiplayer unlimited games. And we're gonna try to get this team as good as possible, led by RJ Barrett. So I'm gonna put it on the screen right now. These are gonna be the stipulations. And the goal of this series is to go 12 and 0 with the team led by RJ Barrett. It might happen early, it might take a long time, I don't know, but yeah, RJ Barrett, man. First, we're gonna go over his stats and attributes, just to show you guys. He's a 99 overall on offense, 94 on defense, 27 Hall of Fame badges, and 17 gold. He has catch and shoot, volume shooter, difficult shots, acrobat, tireless shooter, relentless finisher, range extender, hot start, hot zone hunter, green machine, dead eye clamps, Clutch shooter, quick first step, downhill, slithery finisher, off ball pass, pogo stick, tireless defender, trapper, consistent and contact finisher, cross key score, fancy footwork, fast break finisher, pro touch and showtime on gold. He has intimidator, bailout, interceptor, needle threader, pass fake maestro, heart crusher, space creator, defensive leader, pick dodger, flexible release, pickpocket, lob city passer, break starter, quick draw. Corner specialist, slippery off ball, and teardropper. Man, that's a lot of badges I just read off. But this RJ Barrett, I haven't really played that many games with him. So, yeah, we're going to have to get used to how he plays. I'm not used to his jump shot at all. But we're definitely going to get used to it because we're going to be taking the most shots with him. And, yeah, we're going to be trying to go off with this guy because our team is pretty bad right now. I'd say our only good players are probably this Jarrett Culver, Don Maker, and maybe Kenny Walker can hold his own. But we do want to get an upgrade to the team, and I think the first player that we're gonna replace is gonna be. Damn, I think I'm gonna try to replace one of my big men. I'm gonna keep Dawn Baker because he's really good. I might either replace Kenny Walker and DeAndre Jordan and slide one of them to the bench because Clyde Drexler and Roy Hibbert are not good cards either. Neither is Ben Simmons, but I mean, he's Ben Simmons. He has pretty good animations in this game. So, looking at his attributes, they're pretty solid all-around card he can dunk he can shoot he can dribble he can play defense he can rebound a little he's super fast and athletic so what we're gonna do is we're gonna get into a triple threat online game with that team right now i'm not gonna be able to use kareem so i'm gonna have to use dawn maker i do have a better team than what i'm using right now but for the case of this series for the sake of this series we're just gonna be playing with the cards that we do have you know in that lineup because that's the whole goal we're gonna try to build a team starting with RJ Barrett as our best player and we're gonna see how far we can take it this isn't gonna be the first episode in the first episode we're gonna play a multiplayer unlimited game and that's when we're gonna try to get our upgrades this is just the intro to the series so I'm letting you guys know to tune in when I drop the first episode but yeah we're gonna try to get as much empty as possible because if we want to buy players we're gonna have to either get the MT for them or I'm gonna use a player from my collection to upgrade to. So I kinda have an idea of who I want for the next episode. That's only if we win the game and we might even be able to get more than that. But the way things are gonna work is I have the point system so we have to win a multiplayer unlimited game in order to get an upgrade. So if we lose, there's gonna be no upgrades. If we win, then we can get a certain amount of upgrades depending on how many challenges that we complete. So if I lose the game and still finish five of the challenges, it's gonna be zero upgrades. If I win the game and I do five of the challenges, what I can either do is upgrade one of my Ruby cards, a certain tier, hold up. I gotta lower the value on my TV so there's no echo. I don't do that. Ah, all right. I don't want the value of the TV to pick up in my camera so I have to turn it off. So we're gonna have to upgrade one of the Ruby cards either to a pink diamond if we get that many upgrades. So it'll be Ruby, then Amethyst, then Diamond, then Pink Diamond. So if we get four upgrades, I can choose to either upgrade one of my Rubies to a pink diamond or I can upgrade four of my Rubies to an Amethyst. So that's how it's gonna work. 
If we lose the game, same thing. I can either drop one of my rubies to a bronze player, which is really gonna hurt my lineup, or I could just lower them all to sapphires, which I don't think would do as much damage because we're still gonna have a pretty nice lineup. RJ Barrett, damn it, man. This guy's fouling me, OD. Hopefully we win this game because I wanna build up a lot of MT. As you can see, I have like, I have 10 MT points. Good move. I have 10 MT, so I'm not gonna be able to buy any new players if I want. And if we're just gonna get one tier upgrade, there's a lot of good budget amethyst on the auction block. And I don't have them on my squad. I have mostly rewards cards, so we're gonna have to get some MT from those players too. This guy is pretty good with that Derek Jones. But honestly, I think RJ Bear is the best player on the floor right now. I looked on YouTube to see if anyone has done this series, and I don't think anyone has yet. So just let me know. I know there's a YouTuber by the name of Killzamoy. He does a uh, Zion's Legacy, and that's what gave me the idea for RJ Barrett Road to Glory. I didn't want to do, you know, RJ's Legacy because I feel like that's just copying him, and it doesn't even sound as good as Zion's Legacy. So yeah, Road to Glory is the name I went with. Let me know if you have any other better names that I can pick from. But yeah, and also the way we're gonna do things, if we do pull a player from packs that we buy. Or if we do get a player from the auction block, we're gonna be able to use him on the team because we got the player from playing the game. And every game is gonna be played with RJ Barrett, all the triple threat matches, all the multiplayer unlimited games. And yeah, I already did all the Spotlight East Sim challenges, so I'm thinking about picking up one of those cards if I get an upgrade to a diamond. But let me know if you have any suggestions for the series to make it more interesting. Yeah, we're just gonna try to win this game right here and hopefully we can get a good reward out of the ball drop. A pack would be good because if we can pack a player right now, this isn't even the first episode. If we can pack a player right now, then it's gonna be a lot easier to get 12 and 0. Cause the team I have right now, it just isn't the best. I know I made a video how to go 12 and 0 with the Ruby squad, but it's really, I don't like playing the game that way, matching up against people that aren't as good as you, so. We're here for the challenge. I want to go 12 0 with a good team. It's RJ Barrett. It's pretty fun to play with. He can do everything on the court. Probably said that already, but he's about to get a dunk right here. Look at that animation. That's really crazy, man. Oh, and if you guys have any suggestions for me, like what cards you want me to upgrade to, comment down below because I don't know who I'm going to pick up yet, but kind of want to get one of the token rewards cards i'm not going to spoil it for you guys for the next episode but he's definitely going to be a good addition to the team we're going to go up with this what the hell all right we're just gonna have to feed rj barrett can you do a post oh left me open damn it man we cannot lose this game right here triple threat games i don't know what i'm going to be doing for them yet I don't think I'll be playing a lot of triple threat games, but let me know if you guys want me to add more triple threat games, or for right now, I'm thinking about just doing multiplayer unlimited. So let me know if you have any good ideas for these series, because it'll help a lot. So leave a like on the video, that lets me know you guys want to see this, and I shouldn't just focus my time and effort somewhere else. RJ, oh, he's selling me out right now. Come on, get a stop. Let's go. All right, come on, push it. Let's go, Jarrett. And that Ruby Jarrett cover is really, really good. There were a lot of other Ruby players I could have picked for my team, but yesterday when the new buzzer beater packs came out, I sold off like so many of my players just to pull packs, and I ended up getting nothing. I had so much MT. And if you guys want to wonder why I have so little tokens, it's because I just got the Opal Josh Smith. And I asked a few of you guys in the comments whether you wanted a series based on Opal Josh Smith. Or if you guys wanted a series based on Opal Josh Smith or you wanted a series based on RJ Barrett. And you guys said Opal, I mean, you guys said RJ Barrett. So that's why we're doing him. We just lost the game. Super unfortunate. Hopefully, you know, the series doesn't go this way, but 
But we are gonna get some MT for our players. Not much at all though. 191. But at least it's gonna help because we might have an issue with contracts, you know, in the future. But yeah, I'm gonna put up on the screen one more time the stipulations. Let me know if I should make any changes. If you think it's too easy, if you think it's you know too hard. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. It was constant. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for episode one of RJ Barrett's Road to Glory. And I'm on the road to the cash, you niggas be mad, my niggas gon' double up. And I'm on the road, sing it fast, pick up, I don't pass, niggas better buckle up. Serving so fast, I might crash, with these on my ass, I'm doing a dash. No, I can't help but get in my bag, no, I'm in my bag, get into the cash. Hey, young nigga, 17, this is the better me, live, but you cannot relate, no. I get some bread on me, know it's a friend of me, waving this shit when I...